Let's go find another storm. When the most intense storms Mother Nature ever created threaten to wreak havoc, that's when the hurricane hunters go to work. We were flying into the most intense weather Mother Nature has created. My name is Christian D'Andrea, and I'm the lucky duck that gets to be in the field directing this bad boy as it happens. Now, one of the things we wanted to capture is, what is it like to be inside of a hurricane in a plane? Strap in! The hurricane is invading the cockpit! So season two of Hurricane Hunters, we're taking the show to a whole new level. We are going places that we've never gone before. We are encountering violence and turbulence like you've never seen before. One of the flights we took this year was a flight into Raphael. And as it became a hurricane from a tropical storm, it went through something called massive cyclogenesis, which is when a storm is intensifying rapidly. Wow, that's incredible. You don't see that out of your office window every day, do you? At that point, it becomes its most violent and most dynamic. And that's exactly the point that we flew through it. In this environment, something horrific happened. We hit an airborne tornado embedded in the eye wall of this hurricane. A violent eye wall. So insane turbulence and lightning strikes all of a sudden converted into, whoa, screaming engines loss of forward airspeed, falling backwards out of the sky, wing dips, starts to fall, plane is stalling. Fall, right in front, fall, bank angle. Superhero pilot reacts immediately, puts that plane into a nose dive, deliberate nose dive, down it goes, regains the airspeed, enough wind is going over the wings to generate the lift you need to stay in the sky, saves the plane, total rock star. I ask him point blank, I've been on 30 hurricane flights, that's the worst I've ever seen. What was that? But that particular area that we were in, in that eye wall, mixed in with the tornadoes that were right off of our wing, without a doubt, was the most severe weather I've ever been in. And hopefully, will ever be in. You will see it all in season two. You will see a plane almost stall and fall out of the sky. So what we're doing is we're rigging drop sounds in a way they've never been rigged before with cameras. Christian comes up with this idea that he wants to get this never before seen shot of a sun falling through the atmosphere. I'm a pretty handy guy. Let's get some drop signs, training drop signs. Let me handle those. I showed up with some top-notch materials. This is my second run at setting this thing up with the camera on the top, and I think I'm gonna make this work. You're here, he's here, you're here, you be there too. Lo and behold, the moment comes. We train the guys as to how to load it, how to turn the camera on. I ain't really saw now. Now, it's going to be a sacrificial camera because I cannot promise that this thing is going to make it, you know. Wow. Hold on, we have a picture of this. And it's recording. Yeah, baby! Check the camera. It was still rolling. Brought it back. Check the footage. It was good. Big celebration ensued. Christian and Andy have become part of the crew. I mean, these guys are practically crew members now. They've flown with us so much. Uh, they're part of the family. Have I told you about my flight suit? Next black tie affair, we felt really quite lucky to be able to go into this world and dive deep.